IRS controversy is going to court. A new lawsuit accuses the IRS of violating the constitutional rights of Tea Party members. The IRS targeted the Tea Party and other groups for extra scrutiny when they applied for tax exempt status. The American Center for Law and Justice filed the suit on behalf of 25 Tea Party groups, including one in Georgetown, Kentucky, two in other parts of Ohio. The suit demands compensatory and punitive damages. Tonight, local Tea Party members rallied to show their anger towards the IRS. Our Natasha Williams was there, joins us live. Natasha, there were some political heavyweights at this gathering, too. Clyde, there sure were. And they didn't mince words on how they feel about the IRS investigation centered right here in Cincinnati. They met at the farm in Delhi. Tea Party supporters in large numbers to hear Republican leaders talk about issues like the IRS scandal. Senator Rob Portman called on the White House to come clean. They have misled the American people, period. Congressman Steve Shabbat also stopped by the packed house. He told the crowd the killing of an American ambassador and three others in Benghazi was unfinished business. That is a true scandal because we shouldn't be lied to by our government, but we clearly were lied to in this particular case. For Portman, the IRS scandal is front and center, and until Congress gets the answers it needs in what he calls this overreaching, inappropriate, and possibly criminal investigation, it must continue. When did the White House know? Well, we know that they learned before the announcement came out, but we don't know how soon, what they did, when they learned. These are why we have to continue these investigations. These questions are important to find out to keep it from happening again. Now, Senator Portman says if they cannot get to the bottom of this very complicated IRS situation, they might need to call in a special prosecutor into this case. Live in the newsroom, Natasha Williams, nine on your side. All right, Natasha, thanks for that report. Now, 